So where we actually learned how to do this was we had a, uh, an investor come to us uh, with 30 properties. He said, I got 30 properties, all done with the branch. I can't get any more. And I said, yes, you can. Here's how we got on his 31st. And just last year, we got on his 40th under personal name at 3% bank rates. So he can continue growing because he, could, he has options in terms of getting his, building his portfolio. You either um, can qualify by yourself, that's a preference, because you, do, you keep everything to, for yourself, or you have to bring in a joint venture partner to qualify in that situation. Then you give up equity like uh, uh, 20, 30% in that situation. So even if you had to pay slightly higher rates, uh, you're still better off trying to get, uh, keep everything yourself as you're starting to build your portfolio. And even like B lenders, which is, there's like eight banks, and then there's private, really expensive. Somewhere in the middle is B, which is, could be one to 2% higher, but it gives you the flexibility to grow your portfolio. So if you got a property that's really cash flows, you can afford to debt service, then do that instead of giving up equity in that situation. So at some point, you're gonna probably need to be, as you grow your portfolio, you're gonna cut cap by the down payment that you have. So let's just say it's all gone. Then you're gonna find out, well, how am I gonna get it? So you got bringing partners to help s provide that funding to, for the down payment, as well as uh, mortgages you might not, no longer qualify for. So going back to that client that I was mentioning, his 40 properties was in a situation where uh, he didn't have a job. His, all of his income was from his rental. So he has no fine, no, no job whatsoever, no T4, it was all rental income. Thanks guys for watching my video. Please subscribe and share with your friends. Email me if you have any more questions. Thank you.